Alright, ladies, how's it going? It's your main man, Luke Cross, or Derek. And thank you for tuning tune in to watch another episode of FIFA 16 player career episode. Uh, this is the quarterfinal of the Copa de España, so it is a really, really important match. My proper intro where I showed the table and all that did not record to my PlayStation. It's like, uh, I don't know, it just not work for the, my intro on my recording, so sorry about the bad intro, but this is the quarterfinal of the Copa de España. We are playing Villarreal. FC at home, as you see there, we have quarter final. We played through the first round of 16, beating our opposition 5 1. Now we are up against an opposition that are on good form last few games. So I'm hoping for a win today, hoping to get through to the semi final. So let's get right to the first half. This is it, boys. Let's go. Quarter final, Copa de España. Get pumped, get pumped. Like, it. let's fucking do this. Quarter final, Copa de España. Does not get bigger than this. I'm on the ball early, getting my early touch in, I'm changing the defender, I'm going to cut back and look for options, I'm going to lose possession shortly, going to try and get back. Uh, they're switching the play, come on, we can apply the pressure. That's a good ball. Take it. Maybe I, I, I lost it stupidly again. Stupid mistakes at start. I'm gonna try and track back all the way. Sorry, I pressed him out. He didn't have to do that. He could have come back and moved into the box. But I suppose the presence of Loopy cost. Put him off. Header. All day. Come on. Put pressure on him. This really important match, guys. Quarter final of Copa de España. It's really vital if we are to get any silverware for this club. Some good head in it. Yes. Oh, he's offside. No way. Hold on, that's. That's tight from where I was watching. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He's offside. Yeah, he's offside. Well, without. <clears throat> we'll put ball over. Creating chances already. Putting the opposition under pressure. Come on, you should have won that back. Hey. Red. Plaz. Just as well, guys. Uh, I should have said at the start of the video, a fellow YouTuber and a friend of mine, Conco Blanco or Conco Plays, is close to 100 subs. He is currently on 98, so if you guys catch, check him out in the description down below and drop a sub, it would absolutely mean the world. He definitely deserves a sub for, a subscribe for that goal. Get him up to 100. What a goal. Uh, well, that was a good goal. I'll rate that. I had the ball here. I cut inside, sent the defender, gives it the true ball, and he placed it to the keeper's near post. Keeper should have done better, but there was no stopping that strike from Gomez. Let's go off to a strong start. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. That's an easy interception. The pass wasn't really Oi, come on, shouldn't have caught flat. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I was hoping to slide through the other lad, not him. If they did not go on, I would have 100% been sent off for that. And he's coming back to give me the booking. It's deserved, it's deserved booking. No complaints there. Should have won that header, should have done better. Come on, come on. I'm open. Look, I'm open. See, that's why I don't like with the uh, ball keepers in this game. They wait for ages to give the ball out, and then when they give the ball out, that happens. And like I was open out in the wing there. Oh yeah, I got my. Uh, I know it's really random. I got my uh, tooth removed the other day. I think it was Wednesday. I got removed. If you remember uh, on my previous videos, I was saying that I have to get removed because I haven't. Uh, two words not meant to be, so I got removed anyway. And Jesus, it was sore as hell. 
really so. And if if any of you guys if any of you guys have got your tooth removed, you guys know the pain of getting removed, and then the afterwards of it, and then having to wash out your mouth every time you eat. It's just really really sore. If you guys have ever had tooth removed, let me know down in the comments below. Ooh. Corner, good defense, good defense. Good keeper. Now see, this is what I mean again. I am open out here again. But he just wants to go all the way up. Come on. Where's the, the pressure? Passing around too easy. Oh, what a save. Brilliant save. Oh, he's offside. Right, good save anyway. My football league in real life started off as well. Uh, we had our first game yesterday away against uh, Cara United. Cara FC or Cara United. Uh, it was a one-all draw. They went one nil up within, I think, 20 minutes, I think. It was it was a really good game. I didn't get played because j alter alternations in the squad. It was such, it was really, really bad weather as well. We drew one all. Uh, our centre midfielder scored a penalty in the second half. When in the first half, I think we can all admit it. Whoever plays on the team, if, if any of you are watching my videos, I think we can all admit that we weren't really at our best in the first half. But then when they scored in the second half came and we switched on, we were the better side because the wind was against us in the first half and we were playing up a hill. Because the pitch, you know some of the league pitches, they're, they're, they're really, really horrible. I know this one was like kind of on a little slant and we were playing against the wind so it was really hard for us to get any long balls up the pitch or any anything to our cuffers but then when the second half came as I said we were more dominant side we were unlucky we were unlucky not to go up and win we should have won a few decisions a few decisions by the referee didn't go our way but that's just the game of football one all drawn in the first game one point on the table it's not too bad could have been three but one's better than none the and there's a goal brilliant build up play as well Sweet as you like. I am not missing from that close. Two nil in the quarter final of Copa de España. This is looking good. Lads. Woo. Brilliant. Have a look at the possession stats. I forgot to go on to that. Uh, we have we have managed two shots. They have managed no. Sh uh, oh shit! Sorry, our goals. We've managed one shot. We've had one on target. We still not. I don't know how that works if we're two nil up. And we've only managed one shot. I don't get it. I don't get it. Anyway, they're the more dominant side in possession. They're being more flush with the tackles. We'll have a 100% shot actually. They have the better pass actually, but hoping for a better second half. It is. It has been a good first half. So without further ado, let's jump right into the second half. We are back in the most anticipated match of probably this pair of career series right now. Quarter fight of the Copa de España. Let's go. Yeah, Sunday League football for me is really, it's really good. Like, I'm young age, I'm only 18 years old, and I'm playing at senior level football. And it is really, really tough. Like, I'm not going to lie, it is taking. I'm still, I'm still learning right now by the day to that senior footballer. Like, I do have confidence in, my, confidence in myself that one day I will be. I'm a second team at the minute, but I do have confidence in myself that one day I will be a first team regular. I'm hoping for it. Like, I believe in myself. Like, I know I have the ability. I know I have everything in my, in my box that I need. But it's just really hard. Like, I'm used to playing with people my own age, but now I'm coming up against people that are in their twenties and their thirties and all and they're, they've got more quality in the ball and all that so it is really tough to adapt it but I have the best team, probably the best teammates in the world that are helping me through it so if any of you guys are watching this, I just want to say thanks for like helping me through it and all like as I said I am still learning to adapt to senior level footballer because I am too old for 18 eight by I think by I think two or three months but I don't really mind because I'm, kind of, I'm really enjoying senior level football to get a view of what it's like. This is my second season at senior level football. Last season wasn't really the best. Injury creeping in, bad matches. I wasn't really adapting as to senior level as I play right back or left back. I, ju I don't know, I just prefer it because I. It, it really seems weird, right? Because I got bullied a lot when I was in school. So. 
bullies obviously have a tendency to take things off and you try and get them back. So as a defender, I kind of think back in the game when I, when I was getting bullied, that when I was getting bullied. So let's say if an attacker takes the ball off me or if an attacker has the ball, I'm going to try and get the ball. I've been told that I'm, a, I'm like a little pit bull at people's ankles trying to get the ball. I, I just do not give up looking for the ball. Like, I'm not trying to be, oh, look at me, I'm the best and all that. I'm not the best. I'm just saying, like, I will never. You take the ball off me, I'm not going to stop until I get back up here. Or me a foul. Foul. Yeah, like I said last season was my first season. I said I didn't really, didn't really adapt to it. There were stages during the season where I was like, no, I, I just can't do this. Like, I think football is not football is not for me. Never mind senior football. But then slowly, I'm starting to adapt to senior level football. The squad, it's a, a tremendous bunch of players in the squad. We had a change of uh, man managers near before the season started. So that they, that kind of uh, tipped us over, but. We didn't let it, let us affect us in our match yesterday, where we drew one all, one point in our first game, and especially in the way ground on bad weather. Like I mean, it was raining, it was windy, it was cold. This pitch was literally out in the middle of nowhere. Like it was actually ridiculous. So come on, now we're on the attack, and that was a horrible ball. Oh, we still on it? No, we're not. There's a few. I'm not the only young player in the squad. There's a good few players from the 17s and 18s coming into the squad as well, and they're adapting brilliantly. To, for the first season, we have a we have a, loads of pe people actually coming in from underage level to come up to senior level, and it's just absolutely brilliant, like just to see that you wanting to get involved at senior level football, and like they are adapting really, really quickly, like and they seem to be loving every minute of it. Like, right, come on, where are you going? You're going nowhere, mate. You've nowhere to go. You've nowhere to go. That's it. Forcing, forcing to go back. That's it. Come on, no one's pressing on me though. Right, my stamina has gone down tremendously bad now, so I'm going to have to maintain that and not make stupid runs. Right, here we go. Now we're in protective possession again. I see him. It was a really, really bad ball. Should have done a lot better than that. Come on, boys. Press them in. Press them in. Force them to stay. Keeper has nowhere to go. This lad has nowhere to go either. He has nowhere to go. Not too much. Come on, press them. Yes, there we go. Brilliant. Come on, now we can attack. Come on. I have nothing left in my tank, I don't think. Come on. I think I'm offside. Shoot. Yes. Let's go. Surely the semi final is our now of the Copa de España. One step closer to get bring a silver to this club. Let's do this. That definitely deserves a thumbs up. Leave a thumbs up if you're enjoying it so far, boys. Let's go. 9.4 rating, just over 3 minutes to go. So he gives it to me, I don't know why he did that, I have nothing left whatsoever. And just for safety, I'm going to I'm gonna request a substitution because I'm not risking pulling up with an injury and missing a few matches due to something that could be avoided by requesting a substitution. What's going on? Take your time, you don't have to love everything up now. Go on, it's on a play for you. It's on a play for you. That's a penalty. Yes, it is a penalty. You're off, mate. Red card. And I obviously requested for a substitution, but since we have penalty, I'm going to watch the rest of the match as a spectator and see how they finish it off. Come on, Marcy. Come on, make it 4-0. Yes, he does. Easy as that. Calm as that. 4 0, and I can't skip these replays. So, we have won the match 4 0. So, I will be back at, with the match board. Just as expected, guys, we won that match in the end 4 0. I don't know why he's saying that. I didn't get suspended. I did not get suspended, did I? Yeah. Guys, did I get suspended? <clears throat> I didn't get suspended that match. No chance. Anyway, guys. We are not through to the semi-final yet. That was only the first leg. Uh, that's Copa de España, there we go. As you see there, we have to play Villarreal FC again, away from our home ground, but we have, we're going to play with the 4 nil advantage, so we are looking the more, uh, how could you say, the more dominant side to win that match. 
I haven't been picked in this match. We are way against, again, Chicken Goujons are back. Come on, boys. Three points needed here today. Come on. Three points needed here today. Oh, two nil loss. We can build on that. We need to build on that. Two nil loss shouldn't be happening at this level. Losing against Goujons. Looks like the next match is against away the second leg against Federal FC. So I'm not going to record this match because it's kind of going to be the exact same. So um, actually, yeah, what the hell? I'm going to record the match anyway. You know the drill. Second half, uh, second leg against Federal FC. We're four nil going in here with four nil advantage. So we are looking the more dominant side and the more. A, I don't know, a higher odds to win this match. So, without further ado, let's get right into this first half of the second leg of the Copa Days Final. It's raining, pouring, the old men are snoring. With Rayel, let's see your level of Copa Days Final. Even though it's 4 0 in Arrogant, guys, you know yourself. This is not going to slip unless the bots just decide to switch off and let the opposition in like they are now. They're only attacking the early stages of the game. Good block by Defender and Willow. I'm going to come and just going to support. I'm going to try against space. That's not on, but why not? Try it. That's a very bad decision. I should not call for that pass. I pull out too much. Oh, hey, see you later, mate. Hey, Montreal. I'll take it. Back. Again. Yeah, nice little one-two passing. And gun lane. Oh, why did you cross it? You could play the long ground would have had a better chance. But it doesn't matter, guys. We're on the attack already. We're putting the opposition under pressure yet again. Come on. Come on, boys. Press them, press them, press them. Oh, I'm not going to win it. I, uh, I really as well in my series that I've started on my channel, the new one about Outlast, the horror game. Uh, yeah, again, I wanna, but I'm not going to talk too much about it. I just want to say sorry about not really doing that much in it. But that's on 30 something views with 5 likes. And that for me guys is it's really really good. I, it's good to see that you guys are enjoying my videos and all. And enjoying the new series. So if you guys want me to start in more new series. Just let me know in the comments down below. My Instagram's down there. In the description. My uh, Twitter's there as well. So if you want to contact me and just say. Hey did cost uh, maybe start a new FIFA series or Call of Duty series. Don't hesitate to ask. I will always I will respond to everything. All my comments. All that good stuff. I respond and I'm always going to have good responses as well and I'm not going to be ignorant and forget what you guys are saying like you guys are is, are the motor for my boat right now that sounded really really weird but you guys kind of get what I'm getting like if it wasn't for you guys I won't be making this video right now and just while I'm in this video as well I just want to say as you guys know I am 18 years of all age so you guys know yourself it's going to be I'm, I'm under pressure by my parents to get a job or try to get a job so I'm currently in the progress for looking for a job right now and I'm just saying I'm not going to get a job for a while but when I do get one my upload schedule of doing five five to six videos a week you know yourself like art is going to have to be cut down due to if I do get a job and what my working hours is going to be and all that so it is going to have to get cut down but I am going to still upload I don't know what my, up, my schedule is going to be in work. If I even get a job, I don't need, I'm only saying this to let you guys know in the long run. I've applied for many jobs. I haven't got called back to any of them yet. So, whether or not they decide to call me back for an interview, you guys will be the first one I will put out on my Twitter, my Instagram, whatever like. But I will still try my best to upload. So, I'd actually really, really appreciate it if you guys could stay with me during this time when I do get a job. Because I will still be up on like YouTube is what I want to do. YouTube is what I want to do. But you guys like have to understand like I'm 18 years of age, my ma my mother or ma, whatever wherever you're watching, whatever way you call them, is not happy with me just making videos all day and really do nothing else. So she's obviously gonna expect me to get a job, so most of you guys can probably relate to that. I don't know how that's a free kick a free kick, but anyway, this is a bit late. 
we are one nil up, five nil on our kid. Surely now the semi-finals is looking more to have a let's call Bialbo's name on it or Bilbao. Now we break. No, that was a bad ball. Like I have pace, but I don't have that much pace. I should be up there, I try to stay back with the Alright, come on, that's all he can do is switch the play, that's all he can do and pass it around the back, that's all he can do. Come on, fight the pressure, stand him, stand him, go tackle. Don't know, I feel like I just have a weird feeling I have a discommunication with these bots, even though they can't hear a word I say. I press Daniel, god damn it, press the opposition. Alright, come on, come on. Alright, we're sitting off. But I suppose we can stay off a little bit. Like, we are fighting it up in our game, we're running it up in the game, so. It doesn't really matter. Just let him do that all day. Pence has it. They have a throw in a dangerous enough area. Not really going to bother us, though. Oh, good ball range. Trying to go for the sport. Go on, Luffy. Use your pace. Alright, that's all that's all he had on, that's all he had on. There was no good options for him available. Gonna ask for short run, gonna receive it. Gonna try going to the box. And I'm gonna screw it up completely. He was nowhere near me, but as I said, I never stop going for the ball, but we stand there on the penalty. That's yours, all day. Like, being a defender in senior level football is, it has its ups and it has its downs, like, it's really hard, like, I'm a small player, I think I'm, like, five foot something, and I'm not big, I'm not big, like, I'm small, I don't have, I don't have muscles or anything like that, so it is really hard, because I'm having, like, really, like, m more mature people that are well better at football than me, that know the game, that have strength and all, so it is really, really hard, but I'm still trying to adapt to it, as I said before. And that's the first half over and done with, guys. 5-0 in Arrogate, surely, they're, yeah, you know, they're more dominant side of possession, but we've managed three shots, two of them have been on target. We keep up the pressure like this, we've been more ferocious with the tackles, having been put in four, they've only managed two. So, 1-0, 5-0 Arrogate, let's get, let's jump straight into the second half. We're making this so bring down Gorilla Melo, or whatever his name is. Come on, let's go. Quarter final the second next. Second half. Let's do this. Alright. We got the ball. Oh. I honestly thought that was a free kick there. That's why I literally just stopped running. Like, put my PS4 controller down the ground. I just thought uh, the ref was going to call it and it was off. Because normally when you get a book in a player career, the star that's above my, above my character right now will go yellow. Like, properly. I know a star is yellow, but like. It'll go proper yellow. A little dink. No, I shouldn't have caught that. I should not have caught that. Hey, come on, let's put the pressure on. Let's put the pressure on. Oh, come on, boss. No point standing up. I know we're winning 5 0, but come on. Never switch off. Go on, son. Oh! Just hit the post. Oh, that is a bummer. I really could have done more with that. I could have fake shot and I could have cut and I could have finessed it. But I guess I just rushed it, really. So. Put pressure on. I can't leave my marker too much, though. Look at He's not not. He's not not. Alright, maybe he has that one on He's offside, so forcing him to stay. We can take our time, we can take our time. Yeah. Hey. Here. Lose it. Great answer. Just 
to it. I said I'm not. I said if I lose, I'm not gonna stop going for it. I said I'll commit the foul. I'll commit, I'll commit the foul. I thought he was reaching for it there. If I'm honest with you, I thought he was reaching for it. I, you guys have watched all my character episodes, and I, you guys know I have got a lot of bookings. After this match, I'm actually going to check my discipline, disciplinary record and actually see how many yellow cards and red cards I have got playing as a left midfielder. I think I have, I have got at least over 15 or 16 yellow cards this season so far. There we go. Come on. Oh. Come on, 21 minutes to go. Oh, good header. That he could stop the goal. We all love looking at goals, Martin, but there's something special about a defender showing those I, kind I of really need to stop uh, making challenges as I am already booked and I cannot risk getting sent off. Ray. Compliments Watch to this, the he's going to come into me. Hey, Ray! The rain was quite heavy earlier in the day. Jesus! Yeah, well, they've got a good pitch, they've got a good surface, good groundsman as well. One play like that. Ray? Oh no, don't be the accomplishment glitch again. Sorry, right, good, but it's only good in that game. Get off me. Oh, that was right at the keeper. Oh. Right at the keeper. Could have, could have easily made that 6 0. Good tackle. Let's mark up. Ref? Ref, can you open your eyes, please? Talk about refs making bad decisions. There are football match yesterday in the Sunday League, Cara. Our forward, uh, Darren. He was on the ball and he's a pacey, he's a pacey player and the defender just couldn't catch him, right? So he knocked it by him. The ball must have been, I say, about five or six yards by the defender and Darren must have been, I say, hey, how am I going to say this? The referee. No. I say Darren was about five, six, maybe seven yards away from the defender as well. The defender lunged in from behind, two foot tackling him, absolutely clipped his ankles. He was lucky not to pick up an injury. You think about that. You, you've knocked the ball by the defender, your last man, your opponent two foot tackle, surely a, a yellow card. No, not even a yellow card, nothing. He didn't even get a warning or anything. He absolutely. He got nothing. Got absolutely nothing so he Should have been sent off. Right, come on. Got after winning the penalty now. I haven't been on penalties in ages. And that goes to prove why, because I bought all the penalties. I had the perfect chance to put my team more in front, even though we don't need more goals. But it was still a chance to prove to the manager that I'm that well I'm well confident from 12 yards out. Right, I need to work on penalties. Oh, I'll take it. I'll take it. Well done. Hey! Ref, will you give something? Come on. Ah! Lost the ball too easy there. Well, too easy. No standing with that. Had a decent enough game, I think. Got the assist. Could have scored penalty as well, but fortunately, I missed him because I heard that. Let's just have a look actually at the match stats. There we are now. They were seeing more down inside the session. They finally managed one shot. Congratulations, guys. We've managed seven, five of them were on target. So let's get straight to the match board. Alright, there's the Copa de España table. It looks like we are facing Real Betes. I think that's the name anyway of the little club there with the kind of green arrow with a crown on it. Real Betes, I think we're fit. They look like they're our semi-final opponents. Excuse me, that should be a really, really good game. Oh yeah, I was going to show you guys, wasn't I, the, my uh, disciplinary record. Just as I thought, look at that. 61 appearances, we've won 49 games, drew 6, lost 6, 77 goals, 24 assists, 24 yellow cards, and 4 
red cards. Now you wouldn't expect that with a left midfielder in all fairness, like you wouldn't see Memphis Depay or let's say Neymar getting bookings like that. You just wouldn't, you just don't see it. So anyway, after that, after them two uh, away wins, after that away win and the home win against Villarreal CF, it leaves us, this always takes a while to roll up, sorry about this, leaves us in the semi-final. So it should be very interesting semi-final, if I if I say so myself. The league match, the league match, however, Valencia are starting to close the gap and after we lost. They are now three points behind us with 41 points. We are on 44 points. So it is starting to look like a season right now, guys. Anyway, this has been the this is the end of my fifth video for today. Thank you guys so so much for watching. If you go on to enjoy, maybe hit a thumbs up button down below. It would mean a lot to me and the channel. Subscribe to Conco or Con Connor Conco plays. He'll be in the description down below. As I said, he's close to 100 subs. So let's get him to 100 subs together, guys. Leave a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. All my other FIFA videos will be in the description down below. Thanks for watching and bye for now.